Mm, mm, mm. Now, you know, when I first started this YouTube journey, and, and I call myself getting together this community and helping and, and teaching new and upcoming guitar pickers and, and, and intermediate or professional players, helping you guys to a different avenue of music or a different genre of music and trying to give you the game for free, even though they said the game is to be sold and not to be told and all of these other principalities and things, you know, I might have heard coming up from the South. And, you know, these secrets are very, you know, <laughs> valuable, especially in the um, the Mississippi educational music community. This is traditional blues and roots music. And so, you know, I was like, I want to give back. You know, I wasn't thinking about that because I'm the only child. I've been spoiled and selfish pretty much my whole life. I ain't going to lie. But, you know, I had this different turnaround while we were going through the pandemic. Pandemic had this epiphany, you know, so to speak, thinking that. Ooh, you know, I'm going to start making videos and entertaining people on the internet. You know, since I can't entertain people in real life, you know, or, in, you know, face-to-face -face interactions. And so, here I go setting up my phone, taking out my personal time to make some video in the beginning. This is how this started out. And then I went from there, the moment I started noticing, oh, you know, I have a few likes on the video. Oh, you know, and years later, maybe two to three years later, it was several little comments at the bottom. But, you know, mind you, I'm doing this for free because I'm thinking I'm helping people out, you know, while we all stuck at home and we can't really go anywhere. Or, you know, what if you want to learn a new instrument or learn something new or, you know, get a, a new habit? And so I do this, you know, days on end. When I first started, I went crazy with it. Sitting here talking to myself, feeling like I'm going mad, talking to a camera, right? Because that's how you feel. If you're not a YouTuber, you don't really know how it feels to sit and talk aloud and listen to yourself and look at yourself all the time. And then when people have the opinions that, you must be narcissistic. And the whole time in the back of my mind, I'm thinking I might be helping you guys out. So never mind the madness or the awkward feelings I have to myself. You know, because, you know, I've been talking to myself for years, right? And even though I've been doing that, it's still different getting on here talking to you guys on this camera. I'm going to get to the point in a minute. Hold on, baby. And so now. We're in. I've invested. I'm in deep. I fully invested. Not only have I just posted videos, I took the time out to study the craft of YouTube. I couldn't stand the internet, mind you, in the beginning, very paranoid individual for some reason. So never really was an internet guy. Even on Facebook, my name was Incognito because I'm like, I don't want too many people to know about me. You know, it's a crazy space. It's a crazy place out here. And so fast forward, you mind all that. And my introvertedness and my social awkwardness, because now I'm more sociable because of YouTube. We 300 videos in. 300 videos in. So that's a lot of hours of watching YouTube to learn about what to do on YouTube. To learn what to use on how to. All of this. I didn't got into camera stuff. I become a whole geek for you and me. I'm not going to leave myself out because it feels good to create videos and stuff like that. So I can't put it all on y'all. But I'm going to put some. I got a bone to pick with y'all. I'm going to tell you. I'm, I'm sincere. I'm not jiving at all. No, I'm not getting out here. You know, I try to be friendly and stuff because you don't never know who's going to watch these videos. Little kids. Everybody watches it, right? But this for the grown-ups. This for the age bracket for 25 because I know you got a job, right? Because you got to gotta have a job or... You around somewhere, you have some type of capability to get to Wi-Fi access. That's what this boils down to. So, 300 videos in. And I was so happy when I got 400 subscribers, right? Because my audience 400 people paying attention to me. I found a purpose, you know, whatever. And so I'm doing all of this stuff. It's almost like I'm, I got a job. Y'all don't understand. This is a job, but it's not a... 
immediate rewarding type of job. Like you have to put in hours and hours like you're going to school. You understand what I'm telling you? And unless you're a collegiate or you're some type of scholar who really loves going to school or, you know, you really love to learn, then this type of thing really is not for everybody. You know what I mean? I'm getting to the point. Hold on, baby. <laughs> and so I learned all of this stuff. And even, you know, even on days where I'm not doing anything too complicated, I take the time out that I can't buy. I can't refurbish. I can't recreate the breaths that I exhale. I can't get that back. I can't get back the time that I took to come sit down in this room away from whomever or whatever and focus attention on you guys. All of you guys out there. All of you. It's a lot of you out there. We got like 600 and some thousand in Kimbrew Nation. And by the way, let me give you guys a hand for persevering my awkwardness. And and, and, and and things that might challenge your thoughts of whatever. Let me give you a hand. Thank you very much. But you know what? I'm mad at y'all. I wouldn't say mad. Let me take that back. I'm disappointed. I'm so disappointed. I thought you guys was really messing with me, right? Y'all had me fooled. I was totally bamboozled. Behooved. Because I'm thinking, you know what? Since I'm giving back, since I'm giving things to you that nobody gave to me, you know, none of these little licks and this stuff I'm getting on here showing you. Matter of fact, I don't allow associates because they like, what you doing? Why you, why you, what you, what you, what you, what you, what you? And I'm like, don't worry about it. <laughs> My spirit talking to me, right? All this old stuff. And I take more time out. Hold up. Hold on, baby. I take more time out, create musical projects that are important to me because they're my baby. You don't get it. Or if you do, let me reiterate it for you. I'm sensitive about my work. And, you know, I try to do these things that are fun and lively, you know, and, 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 and something that could actually help us out. You know, some music, some good time stuff. And, you know, in there, not just no Baba Baba stuff. You know what I'm saying? Some, you know, I put my time into this. And I'm sitting here and I'm talking to the universe and ancestors. You know, what should I say to the people? Ah, you know, type stuff sometimes, for real. And you guys do not click on those videos of Electric Juke, the EP. How could you? How could you not click on this project that I've spent? It's been four years I've put into this. About four or five years I put into this project. And I know it's not all Hill Country Blues or, you know, all guitar, but I did this and invested this energy into this for the entertainment, for the sole purpose of the entertainment of the globe. So I gave you all of these videos. Once again, thank you. Thank you for watching. But I, I'm disappointed. Because you're not clicking on these new music videos or new music projects. It's called Electric Juke, okay? It's my EP. I released it on my birthday. It's a six-song EP that consists of six individual tracks. One of them is an interlude, which is kind of like spoken word. Some stuff I want to say. But I'm just... I was I was going I was going to pick up the guitar and do another video on you know my um one of my singles on there take my time I was going to show you guys how to play that if you wanted to know I'm sure you probably want to know maybe maybe not but the least you guys could do for my time for free you you didn't even you didn't even do a, a super thanks like my guy did earlier, you know, to him. Thank you so much for hitting the super thanks and and really supporting I, that super thanks. Appreciate it. You know, I go to work. I'm not just sitting around. I got a job. I do work, you know, even when I'm not touring. I go to work, man. I got to work, man. Because, you know, this blues ain't making me rich. You know, it don't really just carry on outside of certain seasons. Thank you guys for inviting me to your festivals. I love playing at your festivals, you know, but... I could play at more of them. <laughs> but anyway, 
Help me out, man. Spread the word about Electric Juke EP by Cam Kimbrough. All 6,000 of you. you. I'm posting it on the site so you can hear it. You don't have to pay for it. It's for sale out there, but you don't have to pay for it. You could just click on the channel that we're on. Let you see these videos that I'm helping you guys with guitar stuff. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to go get something to eat because I'm just... I'm astounded. I thought, I thought, I, Kimbrough Nation, yeah. I thought we was, I thought we were to, oh, 